Burger, burger, hamburger, their song from a burger mm -hmm. show. If you can't sing, just hum along. I'll tell you what I There you go. That's DJ Mark Neely playing one of our favorite hits. I don't even know what it's called, Burger Burger, I think. This week, Burgers with Buck headed to Atlanta's wild, wild Upper West Side for not only a really good burger, but it also came with a little local history lesson on the South. All right, this week, Burgers with Buck, we are back on Atlanta's Upper West Side. Some people didn't even know we have one, but we do, and I think you're going to like it. We're at the Woodall, and I'm hanging out with with Rick and with Ben. How are you guys doing today? Great. Doing well, great. How are you? Doing great. Let's talk about the Woodall. First of all, the name has a little bit of history in, uh, in and of itself, but tell us about the name and a little bit about this place for someone who's never been here. Great. No, the, the name is kind of a fun one. It is uh, in relation to this neighborhood. There is a little dry uh, creek that was uh, feeding into Peachtree Creek and Moore's Milk. Uh, called the Woodall, and it was a very important creek to, to this neighborhood 100 years ago. Uh, but the, the name Woodall itself also means uh, hidden place, and it's kind of a neat, neat uh, take on a word there that means something to the neighborhood. Uh, famous for our steaks and seafood, but we also have good influence of uh, some uh, pastas and uh, a little bit of uh, uh, Asian in there too. And what we're known for is finding great burgers around town. And I'm hoping we've come across one right here. Ben, what do you call this? Yeah, that's, uh, you're, you're not going to find a better one than that. So that is uh, the Woodall. I want to hear everything about how you put one of these together from the very beginning to the finished product. Yeah, you know, as, as you can see, there's really not uh, a lot on that plate, right? So we really got to trust that our ingredients are the best that we can find. So there's really, you know, four things on there. The, the bread uh, is an awesome uh, hala you know, brioche style bun that we toast with butter, just get it perfectly toasted. Uh, the burger patties themselves are a Wagyu patty. Uh, so a lot of richness and, and fat in there. Uh, and they're seasoned really well with just simply with salt and pepper. Uh, some classic American cheese, can't go wrong with that. Uh, mm -hmm. And some nice pickles on there. So, you know, we're just, we're just, uh, uh, you know, believing in all of our ingredients that they're the best. And, and when you put them together, you'll soon, you'll soon see why. Um, you know, and, and that what we serve with uh, our tavern fries um, that that we do in, in house, and so those fries are, are cut, uh, peeled, cut in house, and we do something a little bit different here. We're actually cooking them in beef tallow, so mm. they're pinched in house in beef tallow, and then they're finished in beef tallow. It just gives us real richness to those fries or something like you've never tasted before. You guys opened in February, but the, the way things are happening in this area, this is a booming part of town. Just a little bit about how cool this area really has become. Uh, th this area is really improving a lot. Uh, a lot of great people are moving in. Uh, housing is booming and it's, it's just been a fun neighborhood to serve. I love it. I love it. And I'm ready to give this a try. Here we go. The Woodall. There it is, kind of a less is more concept, but if you do it with high quality ingredients, sometimes that's better than piling one super high with all kinds of stuff. But I'll be the judge of that, right? Here we go. You know what, gentlemen? <laughs> that's really good. <laughs> Excellent. Reminds me of like a really, really good backyard burger, except way better than the ones we had in the backyard growing up. Thanks, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you, bud. Mm -mm -mm. Sometimes less really <laughs> is more, and the Woodall Burger is certainly a great example of that. Sometimes more is more, too, though, and Atlanta's Upper West Side is becoming an example of that. I don't know if you've been over there, Portia, but it's a pretty cool area.